Hello and welcome to the Brick Freaks. Today we have Pirates from the company Jegao. It's, uh, it is under the cover of Lele and model number here is QL1803 and it's a pirate ship and this is $48 with worldwide shipping for 1334 pieces it looks nice I don't know if this is a, a own set a set inspired by Lego a clone set I don't but I don't think that I don't believe there's a Lego ship that looks the same or is this a stolen mock Perhaps, I don't know. Perhaps you can help me. Look this fam familiar to you? A Mork or a Lego set? Is it a clone? Is it an inspiration? Is it totally new and independent made by Jigao? I don't know. The instructions from Jigao, the old building steps are grey. All the new parts are coloured and you see it with, often with arrows. So, they are okay. Not, not very good, but okay. Should be no issue. Perhaps the colors, when there are three different brown tones, then it could be a problem. This is the nice ship looking from behind. Many adventures are waiting for us. Uh, these are separate bags. The rest are seven building steps. Bigger form pieces. Uh, stairs, weapons and so on, sails, uh, smaller form piece and then here we have seven building steps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, or seven, six, six, seven. So the, each building step has only a hundred pieces or something. So it should be an enjoyable build with not too much searching for any pieces when you have hundreds in front of you it should be go very fast I hope it and I don't know how the quality is the last or the first products I had from Shegao were their houses and the quality was very good of the pieces here we have obviously go bricks pieces too and uh, I hope we have the same good quality and have an enjoyable build so hey ho Let's go and build a pirate ship. So building step one is finished and this is here. Front and rear are the same piece. Then we have our eight round modified tiles or I don't know. And a place for eight cannons. Ammunition, the studs as ammunition, a little bit of some bricks here. Over there is first a layer of plates, and then here are some bricks, and the holder for the mast, and I believe it's mast, or M-A-S-T, mast, A-B-A, -A, mast. I don't know. It should be. Normally, my Google Assistant says the word, or, and I know how to pronounce it if I don't know the word, but here with mast, it's the same writing than in German. In German, we say must, like you are M U S T. Okay? Uh, the minifigs are Lego minifigs. I'm a little bit disappointed, but well, okay. Better than the old ones or the new ones from Jigao. They delivered with the two modular buildings I reviewed from them and uh, built two absolutely great sets, but the minifigs were crap. And here is a, uh, yes. They look like Lego, they are illegal, 
in or to sell it normally. So what should I say? But better than the others, the others I would have thrown away. These here I can keep. So better keep it than throw it away. We have enough trash. So building step two is finished. Brought us here the slopes and the golden bricks. Slopes, inverted slopes, the cannons. Technic brick. Technic brick. That's a nice rhyme. Technic brick. Brick, brick, brick. Inside we got uh, some bars. I don't know what's uh, under the captain's room. I don't know the English term of a, a ship room. The German I know. Okay. I don't know the English one. But for the review I will Google that. I don't, so I don't know if this is uh, for food, for uh, weapons, for guns, or for prisoners. I don't know. Or for treasure. Well, so far everything is... Uh, here the... Uh, They are working great, the cannons, no problem. You can't move them very much because they are uh, the arches. So movement not possible, but it's okay. And it's stable, so very good at the moment. So, end of building step three, we got the front here. Or later the figure, I believe. There will be a figure. There must be a... Yes, there is one. There is one. Okay. At the rear <laughs> of the ship, I know it's not rear. In Germany, in German it's Bug and Heck. I don't know what's in English, but I promise you, I for the next take, I will Google it. So you don't have to listen my bad terms for ship parts. Okay, we got here for the captain's room. I know room is the wrong word too. A small desk, a small stool. Well, I believe I did it the wrong way, did I? I? I assembled the... I'm sure I assembled... No, it's right. <laughs> it's right. The print here of our map, our treasure map, or whatever, whatever, is absolutely okay. The ABS here is a little bit milky here too, but for a glass here, it's I don't care. Here the palisade bricks. We got the rudder. That's the total look. Here we have a Technic brick. Hey, a, a small three-length lift arm. The wedge blade covers the front, and here two normal blades and two small wedge blades cover the rear. So till now, it's a really enjoyable, fun build. Quality is good. Instructions are okay. Nothing, nothing to complain about. So this is building step four. Brought us here the walls for the captain's room. They are made with hinges. The torch here easy goes away. So okay, that's nice here. This is angled too. Open bowl too. Here walls and something here for the mast. No oh, wall, well, this is really an enjoyable build. The only thing I don't like here is the wedge plates are a little bit hanging through here. I 
have to take away this plate again and look if I missed something. No, the door is stable. I don't know. I believe I did something wrong. We will see. But so far, it's a very nice ship. For $48 or something, what's this cost? Really cool ship. Finished building step 5, brought us here. The anchor, and the chain, and the mechanism. But the chain has to be <laughs> built again from all these little parts. Oh, this is a mess. The long X here is going not too easy in here. You really use a little, I had to use a little force here to get it really through. So I warned you. I needed no hammer, but it was really, to get it really so far in the ship, it's not easy. You see this in the last take. Oh, and again, the torch. Gonna. So, here the. I don't know if this is it the frame or the window pieces. But from Zhigao in the two modular buildings, they were so flimsy here too. They wobble around if you move. See this? Yes. That's, that's maybe a hinge. This too. That sucks a little bit. But okay. Next bricklink order. I order first the windows in hope <laughs> that it is the windows and not the frame. We will see. Rest in blue flames. And here chains two and red flames. Okay. So, building step six ahead. And this is the ship after building step six. We accomplished here the rear of the ship. And I checked the, the Lego ships. There's no pirate ship or in the pirate section that looks like this. This is a mixture between the Black Pearl and the Queen Anne between the black and the red ship from Pirates of the Caribbean. For the Black Pearl, the Black Pearl has only two cannons. This here has four, like the Queen's Anne. It looks, for, from the size, it's more like the, the red ship, but from the color, it's more the Black Pearl. So perhaps Zhe Gao just cloned these two sets in one, I don't know. But this seems an a self-constructed uh, set. There's, uh, I checked rebrickable, there's no mock actually. Oh, here we have the galleon figure. That's nice. So, but for today the video is finished. Yes, I'm an ass, I know. Cause the last and seventh building step you will see in the review when I assembled this whole set here. But till now, that's really a cool set. I love it. Made a lot of fun, looks cool. Perhaps I wouldn't choose blue here. But the rest is really, 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 really nice. Okay, so thank you for watching. And I hope we see us in part two, the review. So you see the final ship with all the sails and the mests and so on. Okay, have a good time. I'm Frank. Bye bye.